everyone, welcome to What Are You Saying? Hashtag Ways, where we talk about topics in the news as it affects us all. I am Osayua Mesale, and today I'm joined by Temi Tokwe and Olamide. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Hello. Uh, Hi, Temi Tokwe. It's been a minute. I know. Hi. How is the financial industry treating you? We're good. It's a lot of work, but I'm glad to be back. But people have not mm -hmm. given us money yet. Oh, it's going to happen. We keep seeing adverts all over the place. <laughs> um, you want education loan? Mm -hmm. You want this? I got mm -hmm. you. No, they're just like, they never... But how easy is that, though, in, in Nigeria? Do people truly access these things? Absolutely. Absolutely. Um, we're lending. Um, now the push from the central bank is really to get even the bigger banks to do because they can see, you know, us in our space doing it and doing it profitably well. I think it has I helped a lot of entrepreneurs. Absolutely. And it's easy to get lost in the fact that, oh, this is what the company is doing, but... I actually get to relate with the people, the beneficiaries. I see it. You hear stuff like, oh my God, I'm glad I was able to get this. I could pay school fees. You know, that's impact. That makes me very happy. Wow. Yeah. So. I hear you. <laughs> lami, Lami, how's the, how's the law firm doing? <laughs> very well. In and out of court. <laughs> I want to sue some people. Oh. Lami, do. So that so I'm ready. That's what I do for a living. <laughs> Honestly speaking, like trust me. Do you know that I had a client mm. who sued her baby's father? I want. I don't want to say baby, baby daddy, daddy, whatever. Daddy. And um, the guy refused for child maintenance. You know, you can actually sue for of child course. maintenance. A lot of people yeah, don't take advantage of that. And the guy repeatedly has refused to come to court. Really? Now the sheriff. Those are the people that go out to serve notices yeah. of the court. Actually, because this guy is a top shot, I mean, prominent person, and the sheriff actually went to serve him the court process, and guess what he did? He thaw it. Uh -uh. Yeah. And told Impunity. the sheriff that even the court cannot drag me to his court. And the sheriff relayed it to me, and I relayed it to the honorable oh court. Oh my goodness. And guess what? <laughs> There's a bench warrant oh issued. Goodness. Wow. No, by the next adjournment, he's saying bye bye. He's going to prison. Whoa, is that serious? The woman was outraged, like she was, she was upset, like what? And I just dropped it. I didn't emphasize on it, but I knew the effect was good. Oh my goodness! So like <laughs> right. in Nigeria, if yeah. you really pursue, if you know what you're doing, mm -hmm. and you know, you can actually pursue stuff with Definitely. legal backing yeah. and get results. Definitely. Yeah. All right. So today is an interesting day. Here's what we found as today's quote. It is important to be a global citizen at the same time, appreciate different people, cultures, and different ways of life. That's from Dakota Fanning. What do you ladies think? Absolutely. Spot uh, on. Spot on, right? Spot on. I always say to people now, when you see people making a lot of noise, go and check how exposed they are. Mm -hmm. mm. It's spot on. <laughs> Quite a number of people say, why do you travel a lot? Traveling is a waste of money. And I told them, no. Traveling itself is education. It's you need it. It's part of life. It's a life skill. Exactly. You, you never. Must act. And I think it's not only just traveling outside the country. A lot of people are ignorant when it comes to Nigeria. Okay. So I currently, think I, my children, I, I, my geography. Is I'm sitting. I'm sitting on that table. <laughs> my children my right now. One of my son is he, he's currently in uh, Tinapa, Calabar. On a school From trip. school. So what they do when oh, they're in year nice. seven, they go to Obudukatu Ranch, they okay. go to Tenapa, they go to... They've been taking them all over the places. And you know, because for me, growing up, this is what I was used Uwa. to. Living in the north, you so have, you have to come do. visit, you know. And the roads were a lot safer then. But well, now, but I'm saying that, you see, trust me, yeah. the only way you can appreciate what, what you have and what you understand yes. is also... You know, having but the intra mm -hmm. intra Nigerian, you know. <laughs> uh, especially with kids when I'm not there, yeah. I'm not. I don't know. I don't All righty. So today we're talking about being a global citizen, and we have Olakule Sharia to discuss this topic with us. But first, let's go take a quick break and see what we found in the news. Please stay with us. We'll be right back. Mm -hmm. 